Folks, Metal and Wood Channel Steve here. I knew this day would come eventually. It's an awesome day, man. There's only 5,200 that was in existence at the time. Went to subscriber Jalen. Had a heck of a good deal discount. I think he's probably happy. He's been using and abusing it. I'm going to get him a few spare parts here and there, but these things hold up nicely. It's oiling fine. I put that put that bar on there to see if those bars are any good I'm trying to compare them to their competitor and we might have a Steve brand of bar come out soon you know it all depends on if I can afford to order 1.5 million bars you know maybe the market's not good enough for clown saws in the United States to order 1.5 million bars because you got to order a lot of bars to get you a discount otherwise you're paying too much man you're paying way too much this thing's oiling just fine you know I, ha I, I didn't I had one I had to borrow one here. I had to borrow one. I'm going to get a whole stack of these and put a little Loctite on them because you know they'll rattle out when you're first putting them on there. But I'll get some Loctite on these and I'll get some nice brass looking trimmed up, trimmed up ones. Uh, this is a magnesium clutch cover. It's a magnesium starter assay. One thing I may ask them to do somehow is uh, extend the mold on this because I like to pull it like that and it's just a little bit sharp I'm gonna ask them if they'll do that if that's not too difficult to do it might be it might be costly and difficult I don't know I'll ask them it's one thing I could notice and then somebody else made a suggestion instead of Phillips in the handles use some uh, use some uh, Allen head or even star bits torques or something the rest of it seems to be allen allen key hex key it's very well built i don't know if i don't know if those phillips are good right there i think that might need to be modified as well that's going to be another suggestion i'll go ahead and start this thing up i don't know if we can get a full dhns on you i'm gonna pop that up i had it started a second ago Let's see if I put it on this piece of orange, what happens? Let's see. Flip that ugly mug. Oh, yeah. Look at there. What you think, huh? Okay. Now, watch this. No choke. Switches up. Ready? I don't know if you're ready. <laughs> I'm not going to try to cut with it right now. I cut with the 5200. It's not about showing off. It's, it's just to me proving my machines are working. And, uh, God, these are nice. I put this up against the freaking Echo any day, man. That's, that's, that's nice. Super nice. I could see myself getting some laser emblem noker stickers. You know, they've already got this, uh, they've already got this, whoops. They already got this etch. This magnesium etch right here. That's a cool magnesium etch on the uh, brand. Now they call it 6200, but really it's got a 58cc um, little motor in it, cylinder, engine, whatever you want to call it, I guess. Sometimes motors can be electric and engines would be gasoline, but it's a small little engine, so you just got to say cylinder, you know, keep it simple. Uh, you know, simple, simple for YouTube. I'm not going to ramble all day, although I would love to talk about this all freaking day long. It's 24-inch bar. I like them with 24-inch bars. Very nice. Like, subscribe, share. Make sure you do me a thumbs up and make sure you do me some comments. And I appreciate you. And thanks. We're almost at 10,000 subscribers, so thanks for hanging in there with me. And uh, take care.